boy everybody it's great to be back boy guys <laughs> I can't believe I'm back again <laughs> Fuck that. I ain't gonna cry. Hey, somehow I always get fucked off the Facebook fuckerberg and the dumb bitch wanted to come on and talk shit about me, but whenever I fucking talk shit back and she calls me a crazy whacked out motherfucker, they get me kicked off. They need a fucking platform that you can fucking uh, fight these motherfucking Facebook jail charges, man. Uh, I want a fast and speedy trial, damn it. I want to look at my motion of discovery and, and go back and get her kicked off. Somebody get that bitch kicked off that I put that uh, first picture of. Yeah. Fuck her. How's everybody doing? Good. God said, let there be light, and there was. Heaven let the light shine down. Whoa! Heaven let your light shine down. Whoa! Heaven let your light shine down. Bruh, bruh. No, nothing's wrong with me. Two, nothing's wrong with me. Three, nothing's wrong with me. Four, something's got to give. Something's got to give. Bruh. Hi. I prayed to baby Jesus today. Hey, I go see my psychiatrist tomorrow, and I will tell you how my psychiatrist lets me know how I'm doing. Hey, Moo. What are you doing, Moo? Did you want to come out and set with Daddy? Yeah, or want to set. Well, it's good to be back. Did you see the Bruiser episode? Great, guys. Did you see the sleuth intuition that I did? And my acceptance award? Boy, I'm proud. I'm proud. Thanks, Bruiser. Delphi, Indiana podcaster. Boy, I took off my bandana. Take off your mask. Challenge accepted. I'm waiting. Wait for it. Wait for it. You are now entering the Twilight Zone. A world with unimaginable things. Dangers that lick and lurk right before your eyes. He's Bridge Guy. Oh, no! See, I'm the only one that can make fun. I'm the only one that knows Bridge Guy and what his favorite food is. I'm the only one that's ever scared Bridge Guy that I know of. Jumped out in front of him whenever I was like 14, 15 and scared the fuck. Maybe I was older. I don't know, but he jumped back and I, I jumped back. I was ready to fucking hit him. I'm the only one that came this close to stabbing him with fucking... A pair of scissors when I was 16 and it grabbed me by the throat over a fucking not getting ketchup or something from the store or steak sauce or barbecue sauce, something. And got out of his house at 16. Somehow always ended up back there somehow, you know, after I turned 21. It's a shame. May, wait, maybe it was 18 or 19. No. 21. 21. Yes. 20. 21. And, um, how are you doing today? 